54 degrees. We officially made it to 98 at BWI Thurgood Marshall Airport. We're in the 80s south of town. It's 83 in Annapolis, north of town. We are in the 70s. And I am tracking just a couple of spotty showers and thunderstorms to the north and west. And we'll likely see a shower or thunderstorm mainly north and west as we head into the overnight hours tonight. Most areas will end up staying dry. So we're going to keep that isolated storm in the forecast. Partly cloudy skies otherwise. And you can look for low temperatures in central Maryland in the mid 70s. We're in the warm sector of a system that's heading our way, an area of low pressure moving into the Ohio Valley. Its associated cold front is going to help to spark some showers and thunderstorms as we head into tomorrow. So I'll illustrate that for you on our future cast. And notice, starting out the morning, here we are, 7 o'clock, rather quiet. And we'll see a good amount of sunshine to start the day. The clouds will roll in by the afternoon. After about 2 o'clock, you want to keep your eye to the sky. I think the storms will hold off just a little bit later than that. But when they come in, they're going to be roaring. They'll bring some thunder, some lightning, and of course, the heavy downpours. We could see rainfall rates anywhere from 1 to 2 inches per hour, and that could likely lead to some flooding. That's why we have a flash flood watch that's been issued. So here we are at 6 o'clock, some extremely heavy rain in and around central Maryland. It moves over onto the eastern shore thereafter by about 10, 11 o'clock, making its way toward Ocean City. The cold front then is going to slide to the south and east, and we'll welcome in some better air that will be heading our way by Sunday and especially the beginning of next week. So we have some heavy downpours in the forecast. Again, a flash flood watch goes into effect starting at 2 p.m. Saturday. It'll be in effect for about 12 hours. And we also have the risk for some severe storms as well that could lead to damaging winds. We'll keep an eye on it all. Remember, triple digit heat index tomorrow, forecasting a high around 95, but it could feel up to 105 at times with the combo of heat as well as humidity. Here's a look at your seven day forecast. Look at this. Finally, a day without temperatures in the 90s. That'll head our way by Sunday. Look for a high temp right around 87 degrees. We'll be in the mid 80s Monday with beautiful weather. 88 Tuesday storms roll back in by Wednesday. Stay with us. We'll be right back.